Having met Russian President Vladimir Putin in Moscow this week, North Korea's Choi Son Hee is now back home. Newly spotted this time was the North Korean contingent carrying a document insinuating space cooperation between Pyongyang and Moscow. Our North Korean affairs correspondent Kim Jong Shil explains. North Korea state-run Korean Central News Agency reported that a delegation led by Foreign Minister Choi Son Yi had returned to Pyongyang on Friday after an official visit to Russia. Choi arrived in Moscow on January 14th and met with Russian President Vladimir Putin, Deputy Prime Minister Alexander Novak, and Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov before leaving on Thursday. During Choi's meeting with President Putin on Tuesday, her aide was seen holding a document that said observation list in space technology fields in Korean. Pundits say the document hints at a possible discussion taking place on technology cooperation between Pyongyang and Moscow on spy satellite or missiles. Choi met with Russian Deputy Prime Minister Novak on Wednesday, and KCNA reported that two discussed wide-ranging cooperation in trade and their economies, among others. While meeting with Russian Foreign Minister Lavrov, it's likely the two discuss details of President Putin's possible visit to Pyongyang. There were official announcements from both countries regarding Putin's visit, so we think it's highly likely this will happen. We will keep a close eye on further developments, including the timing of Putin's visit to North Korea. The South Korean Unification Ministry added that the international community was closely monitoring North Korea-Russia relations and the cooperation between the two must abide by UN Security Council resolutions and should be done in a way that promotes peace and stability on the Korean Peninsula. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.